boy bones and we have made it to the final shelf once um, let's get it over with first up we have the whaler trilogy which is la llorona which is a mexican urban legend uh, i think they're making the movie modern day horror up next we have walled in um it has a slip i've uh, never seen this one This is a cool movie, Wait Until Dark, with Audrey Hepburn, where she's blind, and these guys are like kissing her out, uh, cause she has like a doll with drugs in it, but uh, this, is a, this is an awesome, intense movie, Wait Until Dark, I never seen this, but I picked it up, Warm Bodies, I know it's like a zombie love story. Uh, Warlock Best Strong Collection with the slip. Uh, part 1, 2, and 3. Um, pretty cool movie. Um, about, uh, well, the first one's about a time traveler that follows a warlock to the present day. And then the other two, I, I don't really... I, I've seen them like a long time ago, but I don't really remember them that good. But now I could re-watch them. On Blu-ray. Cool. Another one of these Masters of Horror. Uh, the Washington. Holy shit. Um, don't know much about this. Have to check it out one day. Uh, serial killer movie, The Watcher, with James Spader, Marissa Tomei, and Keanu Reeves. Um, don't I seen this a couple times, but I don't remember it that good. I don't think it's that good. Not memorable. The original double feature of Waxwork. And Waxwork 2, Lost in Time. This is an awesome movie. I always watched this as a kid. I love the the mummy part in Waxwork 1. And then the werewolf part. It's awesome. And I have the Bestron Collector Series. The Slip. Um, I mean... First one's a great, great movie. Second one, I never really seen it that good, but I think it's okay. Oh, Wendigo. Uh, I've never seen this one. I've been wanting to see it, but I just haven't watched it. But some wood horror in the woods. Uh, Werewolf, Rest in Beast. Uh, I think this one's pretty rare. You don't see this one around. Cool. Um, Werewolf, The Beast Among Us. Stephen Ray. Never seen it. What Lies Beneath. Harrison Ford, Michelle Pfeiffer. A cool ghost murder mystery. Kind of movie. When a Stranger Calls. The original 1979 Carol Kane. Um, this is where that whole uh, Have You Checked the Children uh, started. And I do have When a Stranger Calls Back. Uh, I've never seen this one that good. I've seen the first one. I never really watched this one, but I do have it for the collection. 
and then the remake uh, stranger calls with the beautiful Camilla Bell oh yeah white noise with a slip Michael Keaton about the EVPs you know the, this this movie is not that good but the documentaries on it are pretty awesome about capturing EVPs and I have white noise too also with slip pretty cool I never seen that one though I have the original anchor bay worker man with the insert uh, this is a cool movie freaky movie about uh, a cop that goes to search for a missing girl and then he ends up being uh, on purpose he was brought to the island so they could sacrifice him I do have two I don't know why but that's a pretty creepy intense movie at the end uh, well I'm not gonna spoil it but it's pretty crazy um, the remake with Nicolas Cage the Wicker Man this one's alright I've watched it before it's pretty good I don't have nothing bad to say about it bees uh, the Wicker Tree I've not watched this I just picked it up one time but uh, I don't know if it's more related to the old one or the new one but we'll check it out Wicked feeds on your fear I love me some witches I'm like really into witches I don't know why they creep me out when I was little but I wish I could marry one wicked little things one of these after is it after dark yeah there's a slip never seen it the wild man of Navidad based on true events it's kind of like a I guess like a Bigfoot like man creature thing I have watched it I watched it one time like really in the night when I was bored uh, it was okay Willard the remake with uh, Crispin Glover the other day I wanted to buy the, the original one from Arrow and uh, they didn't have it at all uh, Oh, FYE, so didn't find it. Cool old school movie, The Willies, with Sean Astin. Um, the guy from Return of the Living Dead. The the guy that hits the tank when it opens up, the old man. He's in here. It's a pretty cool movie. It's an anthology. A lot of like kid themes, but. Actually, it has a lot of like pretty disturbing images and stuff. I do have two, but this was like a different release. Um, still sealed. But pretty cool. Oh, Wind chill, Emily Blunt. Oh, never seen this one. Some kind of horror. In the snow. Of course, Wishmaster and Wishmaster 2. I seen Wishmaster 1, but I haven't really seen Wishmaster 2 that much. And then Wishmaster 3. Beyond the Gates of Hell. Definitely not seen this one. The Witch. Awesome. Awesome movie. I mean, some people hate it. Some people like it. I love it. Uh, slow burn, but I mean, has a lot of cool parts in it. Um, good story, good acting. Uh, I don't have a hard time understanding the old English. I, I understand it pretty good. Uh, the Blu-ray. I mean, the two, the my two favorite scenes are like when the devil actually becomes uh, flesh and he appears to the girl. And then at the end when she goes to the witch circle and like starts levitating it's like, oh man awesome and then I have this like pretty rare uh, steelbook 
Had to order it. You don't really see this one around a lot. It's still sealed. Uh, Wolf, Jack Nicholson, Michelle Pfeiffer, and um, what's his name? Um, James Bader. Kind of a weird take on the werewolf movies. I remember I ran across the DVD and I didn't pick it up. And then when I went back to look for it, it was gone. But then later I found that Blu-ray, so it all worked out in the end. Uh, Wolf Creek, pretty crazy uh, killer movie in Australia. Unrated version. Uh, this one has a pretty cool documentary about the true crime that happened um, in Australia. And then Wolf Creek 2. Mick. All right, went ahead and moved the camera. Keep it going. Wolfman. Like a crazy release, huh? This is pretty weird. Um, not sure which Wolfman this is. Um, pretty cool DVD. The remake of The Wolfman with Benicio Del Toro and uh, Anthony Hopkins. I've seen it. The Blu-ray. Wolf Moon. Never seen it. Some cheesy Wolfman action. Uh, the Woman in Black. With um, Harry Potter. Uh, creepy ghost movie. Woman in Black 2. I've never seen this one. The Woods. Bruce Campbell's in this. But i never seen it. World War Z with Brad Pitt. I think they're making a part 2 of this. It was pretty good. Zombie infection movie. Would you rather? I heard a lot of people talking about this recently. Uh, I never really seen it, but um, I do have the Blu-ray. Um, some people say this is pretty good, but I never watched it, so can't say much about it. Uh, WrestleManiac. Uh, I seen a review of this, so I know it's pretty cheesy. Um, Layla Milani was one of the girls on the Diva Search on WWE, and uh, it has Rey Mysterio, but not the the dwarf Rey Mysterio. It's actually his uncle, who's the original Rey Mysterio. Pretty cheesy. Awesome, awesome movie. Wrong turn. Uh, I remember when I first saw it, it was like really good. I mean, a lot of the special effects and um, were like really great. It, a lot of practical effects. It, it was, it was an awesome movie. Uh, the beautiful Elijah Dushku. Um, I rewatched this one a lot of times. It's a good movie. That's a good one. Well, here first, here's this uh, Walmart. Uh, uh, last year where they were selling the alternate covers Like a coloring book inside, but it's still sealed now. We'll get into the sequels Dead end unrated um, This one has uh, what's his name Henry Rollins black flag Wrong turn three left for dead I mean, the more you get into these, I've never really seen these. I think I've seen these three, but that's about it. Um, this one uh, has a slip. It's uh, Wrong Turn 4, Bloody Beginnings. I guess this is like the prequel. Would be nice to do a marathon and watch all of them. Uh, wrong Turn 5, Bloodlines. 
like I said, these I don't know that that well, but I do have them for the collection. And wrong turn six, last resort. I don't know if there's any more, but that's all I have. Oh, you're next. Awesome, awesome movie. Really good. Has a lot of uh, recognizable actors in it. Uh, has a Blu-ray. Pretty good story. You never seen this? Check it out. It's really, really good. Oh, nah, this is here, but yeah. Young Fra Frankenstein, Mel Brooks movie. Um, Gene Wilder and uh, Terry Gar. Here's another version. That guy with the eyeballs is that's crazy. Marty Feldman. That's right. And I have the special edition. I have watched I have seen that before, especially when I was little. I've watched it before. Um, Zodiac, pretty cool movie about the Zodiac killer in San Francisco. Uh, Robert Downey Jr., Mark Ruffalo, and um, Gyllenhaal. Uh, I do have the two disc director's cut. Um, I, what I like about this movie is the soundtrack. and um, It's pretty long, though. If you ever try and watch this movie, it's, it's Goodfellas-ish. Long. Zodiac Killer. Um, I never seen this one, so I don't know much about it. Um, might have to check it out. I do have two. I don't know why. Must have messed up. The original zombie, Lucio Fulcha. This is a pretty cool movie. This is the Anchor Bay release with the insert. Zombie Honeymoon. Never seen it. Just picked it up one day. Zombie Land. Awesome, awesome movie. I, I saw this in the movies actually at the theaters. Uh, Emma Stone. Uh, Abigail Breslin. Jesse Eisenberg and Woody Harrelson. Uh, I remember when I saw this at the movies, um, when that guy shot uh, Bill Murray. Oh man, I lost it, bro. I was laughing and it was, it was hilarious to me. That's a pretty good movie. And the final movie is a cheesy Mexican made Zona de Silencio, Parallel 27. And what it is about is there's a area in Mexico that has like uh, UFO sightings, uh, a messed up gravitational pull, and a lot of like weird, weird happenings there. Uh, look it up, the Zone of Silence in Mexico. But there's actually a Spanish made or Mexican made movie about that area. So, uh, oh, all right, guys. So. That was it for the shelves. Uh, let's see what next shelf I put up. I have to decide. Later. Then when the herd of good man came singing songs of love. Then when the herd of good man came singing songs of love.